Alrighty guys, so I'm inside a jailbreak and I'm going to be talking about which vehicles you should own in 2021 that are very important as for speed, grinding, etc. And let's get started. The first vehicle you should definitely own in 2021 for grinding especially is the army heli. Now the army heli is actually very important for grinding if you are looking to make a lot of cash. You can literally make an entire crew off this and you can obviously go to the Tom Robbery Museum etc with this army heli with your crew especially and you guys can use this army heli for many things and it's much easier you can obviously easily land and then you can obviously take off whenever you want after you're done robbing something so the army heli is the number one thing I would definitely recommend grinding for when you're starting out the next vehicle I would definitely recommend at least the second priority vehicle that you should definitely get is the volt bike now the volt bike was actually revamped recently and the first version of it looks like this pretty modern pretty good but it was actually bugged for quite some time and you can do various glitches with it but now it's pretty clean and uh, it doesn't climb terrains but it is extremely fast it is now one of the most fastest vehicles inside the entire game almost as fast as the torpedo i don't think as fast as the torpedo but almost closest to the torpedo but uh, it is quite fast and uh, it can definitely go a really 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 long distance and uh, it is very good for chases police cops chases and you can definitely turn in your robbery cash very easily with this. So the Volt Bike is the second vehicle I would definitely recommend getting when you're starting out jailbreak if you are looking to make some serious bucks. I mean, I would definitely recommend the Army Heli over the Volt Bike just because you can fly over it and you have more people to grind out with. Because now that we have the Tomb Robbery, we definitely need more people with you to grind the army heli is the number one vehicle I, I definitely recommend getting but if you are doing solo robberies such as bang jewelry store small stores i would definitely recommend the volt bike the next vehicle i recommend everybody getting if you are looking for not only speed but for style is the mclaren it is a very very sleek vehicle and uh, has a nice interior to it but we're not here to talk about the looks of it we're here to talk about the speed now the speed of it is quite fast as you can see there's a train over there now we can obviously easily catch up with this So you can definitely catch up with this very easily. You can obviously have three people in it. You can rob the train. Having an entire crew in it is perfect because the McLaren has three seats in it, including yourself. And you can literally carry an entire crew in there. And with those three people, you can go to the tomb robbery and all three of you can rob the tomb robbery. So for the tomb robbery, whenever you're grinding inside of VIP and you guys are wanting to have a small vehicle for yourselves, not really a big vehicle like the army heli, this vehicle is the number one thing, number one priority you should definitely grind for. And uh, whenever there's three people in the car, you can easily just come over here. Just the three of you coming here, robbing the tomb. And uh, you don't have to have like a really ginormous vehicle that you have to go all the way back for. You can just have a simple McLaren. And then whenever you guys are out of the tomb robbery, you can just spawn it in. And then you guys can back, get back in your car and then you can go to the next robbery and rob the next location. So the McLaren is the number one thing I would definitely recommend buying when you're starting out if you're not looking for a really big vehicle and if you don't have a really big crew. The next vehicle I would 100% recommend getting and actually I think out of all of these vehicles, the Roadster is a vehicle that I would really, really love everyone to have. Now the, my reasoning for this is, well, this. I mean the acceleration is just very fast. It's a very nice vehicle from the inside but we're not here to talk about the inside of course. It seats two people of course not a crew like the McLaren but it is a very fast vehicle and if you're only looking to grind solo and if you're only looking to grind the museum and other robberies rather than the tomb robbery this vehicle is the vehicle i would definitely recommend getting i think i would recommend everyone grinding for the roadster after you get the army heli but the roadster is a very cool vehicle that you should definitely have in 2021. the next and final vehicle that i would recommend everyone getting when you're starting out the game is the regular tesla now the reasoning for this is because number one it is a little slow but it's also very fast you can see four people in it you can have a little small crew making cash with you and it is very useful i definitely do recommend getting the tesla when you're first starting out the game it is only 16,000 cash from my memory 
Going for the Tesla wouldn't really be a problem. You can literally get this car in like one day and then you can right away go for the Army Heli. It is a very fast car. You can seat four people in it. And my recommendation is going for the Tesla if you obviously want a nicer looking vehicle than the Camaro or the Jeep. It's nice, it's fast, it's speedy, it looks good. And seating four people in it with a small crew makes you much faster cash and gets you to the Army Heli much quicker. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Quick to the point video, subscribe and notifications. One day you can get rich like me because like y'all boys just rich in this game. Uh, let me know what you think about this video in the comments and I will see you guys in the next video.